Welcome to the power of pictures, digital illustrations, a digital media academy certified schools flex learning course. This course explores an important part of literacy, the ways in which we use images to convey meaning. Throughout human history, images have played a major role in the ways humans communicate. But today, in a world full of advertising, social media, and memes, images have taken on even greater importance in the ways we share information. We use pictures to sell products, to win elections, to educate, and to entertain. What's more, digital technology has put the power of creating and distributing images in the hands of people all over the planet. In this course designed for students in grades 1 through 5, students will first practice interpreting images, and then learn how to create digital images through a series of challenges designed to hone their skills. They'll even get a chance to create digital illustrations to tell a story. As always, we recommend that you follow these steps to start your preparation for teaching the course. Step 1. Go to the course overview in the teacher resource module. Step 2. Review the description and key learning outcomes for the class. In this case, you'll see that students will learn to understand the relationship between images and text, use digital art tools to create and edit illustrations, identify images that represent specific ideas and that are tailored to a specific audience, and design and create interesting projects combining illustrations and text. Step three, in the course overview, you can find the teacher guide and specific teaching resources. It is easiest if you download and print the included teacher guide to assist you in planning for each session of the course. Links to lesson materials are also included here. Lesson materials such as handouts are organized by lesson and module for easy printing. Step 4. Review the required materials and equipment you will need for the course. You can see here that you will need computers and or tablets with an internet connection, smartphone or camera for taking pictures, common classroom materials such as paper, pens, pencils, etc., projector or smartboard to display course materials on the board for the class, printer for lesson materials. A core principle of the course is that young people can learn to read the visual world. If they understand it better, they will become better communicators themselves. The next step after reading images is creating images. And in this course, students will focus on creating digital illustrations that can accompany text to tell a story, or that stand on their own to express ideas and emotions. This skill is easily integrated into any course in which students need to do presentations. Language arts, science, social studies, arts, etc. In videos 1 and 2 of the Power of Pictures digital illustration series, we'll identify opportunities for you to integrate the activities from the course into your other subject areas. Returning to the course modules, we see that students will begin by reading pictures in module 1, by using the familiar format of picture books to analyze the meaning of different pictures. Looking at pictures for clues about a text's meaning is a central part of early literacy development, but it often falls by the wayside once students can read. We'll revisit the world of picture books in module 1 to help students develop visual literacy. In the second module of the course, Students will have the opportunity to create simple illustrations that match their interpretation of a text. They'll use these images to help tell stories. This purposeful creation of illustrations, that is, deciding what should be in a picture, will help students understand the choices that illustrators, graphic designers, filmmakers, and photographers make all the time. In Module 3, students will begin using free web-based digital illustration platforms. Once they get the hang of how they work, they'll start with their first simple digital illustration challenge. Plus, you'll push them to start thinking of important considerations like their target audience and the specific design choices they make. In the final module of this course, students will combine their conceptual understanding and skills practice to undertake a series of challenges in which they create digital illustrations for book covers and book pages. By thinking about the meaning of the story and the elements in their illustrations, they'll be making a major step in their visual literacy. Just as we go from learning to read to writing as literacy develops, your students will be moving from interpreting to creating. Now that we've taken a look at the big picture, let's start digging into the course details. We'll examine specific lessons and activities to identify effective teaching strategies, opportunities for curricular connections, and ways to maximize learning.